Hello guys! Ugly Dog Gaming here once again to tell you what's up and what's down. Today we're going to talk about Justin Carter. Justin Carter, who is that, you may ask? Well, he's a gamer like you and I. Oh dear. <laughs> God bless his soul. So, he was arrested for eight years. Eight years, you may ask? For what? What the hell has he done? Playing a game of League of Legends one day. This has nothing to do with League of Legends, Legends, so don't worry. He was just playing it, enjoying himself. Out of the blue, someone's like, man, you're insane. Okay. They played their game. After it, he goes on Facebook. This is Facebook now. He writes, Yeah, I am insane. I'm going to shoot up a load of high school kids and eat their still beating hearts. JK and LOL. JK and LOL at the end bit of sarcasm it should have raised some red flags yes oh dear if that's if that was my kid I'd be like oh you need some counseling boy oh 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 my god man why would you write something like that anyway it was a joke it was a joke someone saw this and was like oh my god oh my god this person's serial oh my god call the authorities He's gonna do it, man. He's gonna, I just know it. Oh, no, not again. Okay, this person freaked out. Being a male or female. They called the authorities. And they tracked this kid down. They tracked him down. They actually spent all that money to track him down. Fair enough, okay? You track the kid down. Start an investigation. Start an investigation. No, they did this instead. Imagine waking up. Oh, man. Oh, lovely morning. I uh, got a cup of coffee. Have my Cheerios. Oh. Mm. Doorbell rings. You go over. Do -do 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 -do. Open the front door, and there's like a battalion of fucking officers. Okay. Hello. <laughs> Are you Justin Carter? Yeah. Uh, I was just eating my breakfast. You're under arrest for writing a comment on Facebook. What kind of shit is that, man? This is fucking crazy. All right, start an investigation. Check under his bed. You're gonna find probably porno mags and a lot of tissues. Because that's it. I mean, this kid's still in jail. They haven't found anything yet. He's been in there for five months, according to this. It could have been. It could be longer. It states he was getting beaten up in prison. Well, we knew that one was coming. Hey, boy, what do you do? Why are you in the big house? I'm, I'm in the big house for writing a comment on uh, Facebook, sir. Sir? You're going to be calling me master in a minute. Bend over. You know, I mean, this is ridiculous. This kid is depressed. This kid is suicidal, right? The suicidal part is kind of alarming. Eight years is a long time, okay? The fact they've had to move him repeatedly makes me think, me as a person, he was probably beaten, probably butt raped, because that, that would do that to a man, that would make you feel suicidal. Sure the hell I would. But they've had to move him so much that they've just decided to throw him in solitary confinement. Now he hasn't done anything that bad, you think you'd send him home. Send him home, get him some counseling, some, you know, a psychologist. Even a fucking asbo on his foot, so you know where he is. But for eight years in prison for a comment? Man, rapists get less time than that. That's all I have to say. Rapists, you know, drug dealers, certain drug dealers get less time. Legalize it, please, because this is ridiculous. But that's another topic. This is crazy. This is absolutely crazy. This poor kid is now mentally, mentally fucked up. Mentally fucked up. No one seems to be talking about his mental state. A lot of people are like, yeah, he deserved it. Yeah, throw him in jail. One less moron. The guy's 19. His brain's not fully developed. He's not in adulthood completely yet. He still lives it with his mom. You know, he probably doesn't socialize with other adults. He's just playing video games. He needs to get out a little bit more. He does need some counseling because that comment was ridiculous. Why would you feel the need to say something like that is beyond me. Anyway, people are not talking about his mental state. Could you imagine him coming out? If he gets out on parole, he's still gonna be fucked up. This is it now, like, I mean, that's enough to send people into shell shock for the rest of their life. You know, he probably won't be able to con converse with other adult men because of it. And this, this person, Whoever it was that notified the authorities, yes, honey, we did the right thing. 
We did the right thing. No, you didn't. You, you destroyed this kid's life. You destroyed his mind. This is this is unbelievable. I, I don't even know what to say. But I hope you see this. I hope you read the article in the description because this is fucking fucked up. Oh, get off Facebook. Get off Facebook, man, because nothing's safe anymore. Nothing's safe anymore. This is ridiculous. You know, like saying this now is like saying it in a mall on Facebook. Facebook's not a mall. It's an internet social site. It shouldn't be taken so seriously. Anyway, please rate, comment, and subscribe. Please write in this, you know, please write some comments on what you think about this, because this is fucking fucked up. Okay? Someone needs to start a petition. Start a petition, because this is fucking crazy. I will sign it. I will click it, whatever. I will vote to get Justin Carter out of jail, because this is fucking crazy. A slap on the wrist would have been necessary. Just a slap, not eight years. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. Peace out.